My hands are orange. They're orange. <laughs> this Jergens Natural Glow and medium to tan and I didn't read the instructions of course not I just went ahead and put it on okay so then last night I went to go wash my face and all this stuff and I noticed my hands were really really orange and so yeah, it dawned on me that it could be this. So then my husband read the instructions today for me. And he said, yeah, you're supposed to wash your hands right after. So they're taking out my old TV. And look at how extremely heavy. They have to put it on a chair that's barely even yeah, handling it. It's like creaking. Do you hear that? This is how big my TV is. Where are you going to put it? So... It's good TV, but it's time to go. It was taking up so much room. How heavy do you say this TV weighs approximately? Know, it's gonna be like 300 pounds. 300 pounds? Wow. So what's the move now? We're gonna pick it up and move out the chair. We're gonna go straight out the door. Do you have the van all the way in the garage? Right. Is it at an angle, the, the van? Okay. That thing was insane. I think I used every single muscle in my body and my wrist hurts actually. Finally got in. This here, I'll show you better, but this here was just sticking out, um, wasting so much space in my room. Anyway, that was crazy. But um, let me just show you the space because uh, the cabinet, um, I have my radio on, I don't know if that'll, but let me just show you the space that it was out. That, that's how much space I lost because it's the back of the TV had a hit, you know, needed that space. So, boy, that was crazy. Um, so we're going to go pick up our TV today. Um, we have a flat screen for my bedroom. And I think we're going to actually put it on the wall, but I'll show you it all when it's done. Um, right now I am putting on I was putting makeup on when my husband needed my help but I'm putting on the Becca foundation the uh, sample I got so I'm gonna go finish getting ready and then I'll tell you how I feel about it and see if I'm gonna go pick it up all right so I've been taking out all of my eBay stuff that I have I have over here taking it all off or out not off I'm taking it all out and um, we're gonna go get the TV now we're going to set it up over here and just work on this room. I feel like I'm drowning in my room because of the eBay. Uh, there's a table that I work. That table right here used to be right here. And then with the TV coming out, I had just a little bit of walking space. Now I already see the difference here. Hopefully today this is what we're going to work on. Eliminating those boxes over there. Consolidating all of this stuff here. Uh, pushing this back so I could put the TV. I don't know if the TV is going to go mounted on the wall or exactly what I'm going to do. This is my old, old <laughs> jewelry case that I really want to get rid of. And I don't know, just really work in this room. This is going to be a project and a half, but uh, we want to, we eventually would like to get a whole bedroom set. I would like to, I don't know if I said this, but I would like to take my computer, put it over here and make this my makeup slash workstation and that's my goal that's not going to happen today but try to get as much as it, I can and then as you can see the sink this is the sink of the bathroom here it's like this flows into the bedroom I, I can't stand that I don't know who designed the root the houses this way because this is my third house that I've been in that has the same flow. I don't like it. I wish it was the bathroom was just totally separate from from the bedroom because it just you can't leave anything on the counter. You can't because if you do, it just makes it just makes your room look messy. I don't know. I don't know. For me personally, I just I can't have that. Like you you wake up in the morning and you you 
you see this overwhelmingness and it's it doesn't start your day off very good at least for me um yeah so i gotta get the ebay stuff more organized and more situated and centralized in my room um and then hopefully with the new tv it's going to give me more space to walk with so anyways my husband's waiting for me so i'm going to get going like it is it too dark i don't think so i have to really see how the sun it's hard to say in the car yeah i'm looking at the becca foundation to because now i'm outside but the car is kind of dark so i don't know i, I like it. It, it i'll tell you what it does do the becca foundation i don't it does minimize my pores my my scarring it, it did it did do exactly what i wanted it to however <laughs> it's very drying for me like it's clinging to my um, dry patches so I don't know I know you can't tell because it's dark in the car but what is can you tell now honey oh. whoa sunroof doesn't look dark what about the look of it though it looks okay. it looks fine yeah So, so, why do you want to eat right now? Okay. Um, I've been logging to my fitness pal, so I've really been trying to really watch how much I eat. Um, hopefully, um, I can um, settle down more and really eat a lot cleaner. You know, there's somebody next to me and they're watching me vlog. Awkward? No. Nah, she's, oh, she's cool. She's cool. <laughs> anyway, I feel like I uh, oompa loompa. Why? Between my hands being look at this. Between my hands being orange. Violet, you're violet. <laughs> and my skin being a little too dark. I feel like a oompa loompa. Do I look like a oompa loompa? No. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. Yeah, because their their faces were orange. Yeah. We're having some Southern California weather, huh? Yeah. Ooh. Good day to go to the pool. Man, what's the temp? What's the temp? Outside, 76. Seven, no, it feels, well, in here it feels like 85, I swear. It's hot. So we're at Baker's, and I'm going to try to make, it's not the, you know, this is fast food, but I'm going to try and make some good choices. Because um, I'm really, 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 really watching how much I eat. Oh, I feel like I'm orange. How did you like? You saw my makeup outside. You look good. Okay. Would you ever tell me if I really look like a Oompa Loompa? I mean, would you be honest and say, yeah, you know I what, would. you you just too orange. Get back inside. Yeah. You would? Yeah. Yeah, you would. Yeah, I know you would. All right, guys, we're going to go eat. There's nothing wrong with that. What? Telling you that? You being honest with me? Huh. Oh, yeah, no. I, I would much prefer that. Mm. See? That means you really love me. Mm -hmm. yeah. If you tell me the truth, that means you really love me. Do you love me? Yes, I love you. Like a lot? Yes, a whole lot. The whole world. The whole world? Yes. Oh, that's a lot. Okay. I'll show you what I got later. Okay, we're home finally. Oh, it is so hot out there. Hot. Hot, hot, hot. So, can you start on the TV? Yeah. I got my TV, guys. Um, I forgot to mention that I ordered the TV, I think it was Monday, we ordered it, or we went to go buy it at Best Buy, but they didn't have it in stock, so um, they said that it was there today, so that's today, Saturday. So let me show you really quickly what I bought. Yes, I've been watching um, a YouTuber named Mrs. The Doll, I believe. I love her. She's, she's real, she knows her makeup, <laughs> and she has said that the Sally Beauty at Sally Beauty Supplies that they had the eyeshadows for 69 cents and that they were good, just a little bit, but they were good eyeshadows. Uh, I think her video was made in February, so I really didn't think that I would find any, but I did, I did. Look at this, I'm gonna show you. Look, look at all this. But they were uh, 69 cents. Yeah, so she says they're real good and somehow they apparently they interlock like you can lock them together i think that's how they go i'm not sure got that at sally's i got quite a bit of shadows and i also bought some hair dye um i got this color let me show you medium red <laughs> so i'm gonna try that 
I got two buy one get one free and then I got the thing to put the solution and all that in there so that's what I got at Sally's oh no and then I got this here for the conditioner so I could put it on after and then at Walmart let me show you what I got at Walmart uh, I heard good things about this elf so I'm gonna try this foundation so I got it in buff there wasn't very many uh, color selection so I got buff I also got this Garnier Garnier whole blends now this is for repairing mask for my hair to see if I can get it you know healthier looking so I got that and this one I got for my daughter at the uh, Dollar Tree so I'm gonna put those on for her today I don't know these or these that I got at Target yeah so I got the petite size for her. Uh, there at Target as well, I got the number seven, um, the Stay Perfect Foundation. I'm going to try that one. I got it in warm beige. I don't know if that's my color, but we'll see. The tester, I tested, they had testers on these and it looked like it was my color. I did get the bare skin. I did get that, so I'm going to try that as well. Hopefully that'll work out. And on this one, I got And I also got this from Essence. This is the uh, dark circles, or no dark circles, rather. I got that. See. So hopefully that'll work. And I got another uh, Sally Hansen um, eyelash curler. I love this one. This is my favorite. So I got that. And I think that's it. I am making dinner right now. I wasn't going to make dinner, <laughs> I was going to go out to eat, but I got to stop that. I have to really stop that habit. Um, we have been out and about, uh, as you guys saw, a little bit of the haul. Right now my husband's putting the TV up in my room and I was laying down just for a little bit and <laughs> I just didn't want to get back up. So I was going to just go run out and get some like chicken or something like that but I didn't. <laughs> so right now I am actually making chicken <laughs> and the kids want mac and cheese and um, some vegetables. So I'm pretty proud of myself because typically I'm typically ha how I've been doing it and uh, how it's been going with me. I just don't cook. I just go out and get something quick. Uh, that's how it's been. So I'm glad that I, I actually did this. My goal today is going to be to work out and to do five miles. Um, yesterday I did four miles of the Leslie Sanson DVDs and the new ones that I had featured in a, another vlog. And I really like these four miles because they're not four miles of like pure endurance in terms of cardio. She does a lot of stopping to do uh, the strength training with the cables and the cord, rather. And so you do a lot of arm and leg, and she targets the stomach. And so it's not like running four miles. You stop and you, you know, do other things, which I like. I think that the five miles, which I've never done before, might be the same. You know, so I'm, I'm going to be able to do it. Uh, unless my husband needs help in the room and doing all that crazy stuff. I don't think I'm going to be able to get everything organized today like I wanted to, but at least the TV will be up for today. So. What's going on? Huh? How's it going? Man, it so much bigger, this <laughs> Let's see. Ah. Yeah. See, I knew I was going to like it on the wall better. Do you want it up higher or is that like perfect? Um, you're going to fix the wires and yep. stuff? That's no big deal. Kind of think it's too high. Really? Yeah. I don't Not know. Not if you sit on this bed. Look at all this stuff we still need to get going on. Uh, That's easy. There's the box. That's easy? Yeah. Really? You know that nail polish thing? Oh, no, I'm saying organize everything. Hmm. I got that. I don't know. What do you think? I like it like that. You do? Mm-hmm. Because I'm, I'm going to lay down and I actually think it would be a little bit higher. But that's higher? Mm -hmm. No, I don't think higher. I think that looks good. Alright. So, jeez. I still want to work out. So, uh, yeah, he's doing really good progress. I think it's a little crooked, though. No, it's not. Okay. 
It's level. <laughs> um, what time is it, honey? I don't know. Like six, maybe? Yeah. Eeks. I got my workout clothes on. I'm ready to go do this. I, I'm really determined to work out and get it done. So, do you just want to do the nail polish rack I got it. after this? Enough. Yeah, I'm going to do the wires right now. And then... Okay. I'm going to take that nail... I think I said that earlier, but I'm going to take the nail polish rack down. I don't want to, but for now I'm going to because it just... There's just too much going on, you know, and... Um, I'm not getting rid of the rack. I'm just going to um, put it away and hopefully, you know, I can bring it out someday. But right now it just looks too cluttered in here and too much going on. I already see this. Let me show you. There's already enough, quite a bit of space walking into my room. So let me just show you for right now. Look at that. Look at that. Look at this is how far it went out here that table right there was here so I mean I only have like a little bit of space so I'm ready to work out <laughs> it's like 7 30 and I was laying down after dinner I kind of didn't feel very well so I went and lay down just for a little bit and um, I started contemplating whether I even wanted to work out but no I, I, I at least want to do three miles at least but I did put the five mile DVD in and I'll see how I feel after the third mile. And you know, maybe I'll do three, four, whatever, five, uh, hopefully the five miles, but we'll see, we'll see. So, I love you. So I'm starting the fourth one right now. This water was about here or so, and now it's down here. I did all five miles. Uh, the last mile I did push myself. Uh, there, I didn't sort of do the moves fully is what I'm saying. Uh, another thing too, um, I must have not walked much today even though my husband and I were shopping, we were walking. I know I lay down a couple times but I really thought I had more walks in my day or steps rather, more steps in my day that I thought that I would reach 10,000 steps uh, around my third, third mile, maybe going into the fourth mile. Um, but my Fitbit, which is at 10,000 steps, it's, it's programmed to alert me when I reach 10,000 steps, didn't actually alert me until the end of the fifth mile. So um, I'm kind of glad that I did do all five because that means I reached my 10,000 steps for the day, my goal. Is yeah, that's it for me for tonight. I don't think I will vlog much tonight after this. So I'm just going to shower and... Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> and that's it. I hope you enjoyed this vlog, and I will see you on the next one. Bye. And still orange.